Hello, 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 and welcome to another Rangarouge unit of the week. And today we're taking a look at the BL 7.2 inch 182.9mm heavy howitzer. So in 1940, Britain realizes, oh crap, our BL 8 inch howitzers aren't exactly going to be that good in the modern war. The main problem is their insufficient range for a World War II battlefield. They needed something a bit more modern. But it's also 1940 and Britain doesn't exactly have the money to completely come up with a brand new design. And so what they do is they re-line these 203mm guns into 182.9mm guns. And that is how the BL 7.2 inch 182.9mm gun entered into service. And these guns would first see combat usage in 1942 in North Africa. But they'd really make her presence felt in France in 1944, as the Allies were sieging down all of these coastal cities. In game, the BL 7.2 inch 182.9 mm heavy howitzer is a 130 point heavy howitzer available to the Czech Division Brigade thing. It is one weapon, and that weapon is the BL 7.2 inch equipped with 182.9 mm. Like explosive shells. 12 of them. It is big damage potential of 9 HE, decent accuracy, and the average rate of fire for heavy guns of this calibre, 3 rounds a minute. It's a big gun. Shoots big shells. Yes. Down to miscellaneous stats, it has indirect fire capabilities, surprisingly, and also a radio. It's a 10 man squad with good optics, good stealth, and heavy cargo space. During battle, the BL 7.2 inch 182.9mm heavy howitzer is a pretty good heavy howitzer. It's going to do exactly what you think a bloody heavy howitzer does, and that is not so much disrupt the front line and try to stress out enemy infantry, but blow up all the really big annoying stuff in the rear, such as anti aircraft guns, other enemy heavy howitzers anti-tank guns, you name it. Now with the Czech division, because they're of course Siege and Dunkirk, have a lot of heavy howitzers available to them, such as the Long Tom, as well as the French piece. Now we could go into fancy crazy comparisons like we usually do with units of the Reek, going over the pros and cons of these units and which ones you should take, but really you just take the BL 7.2 inch 182.9 millimeter heavy howitzer. And it's not due to anything fancy, it just has a bigger high explosive capacity. It just does more damage. It's roughly the same price. It makes bigger booms. And you want the biggest booms available, right? You have pretty decent availability of them as well. Two in B phase, four in C phase, two cards available to you. And of course, this is how the rest of the division is set up. I mean, this is the heavy artillery spam division, especially good for 10v10s. So you can quite easily set up entire batteries of these heavy guns, you got the radio traitors row, which is extremely beneficial, and you have a decent amount of recon and radio to take advantage of that. Overall, the BL 7.2 inch 182.9 mm heavy howitzer is a good heavy howitzer. It's nothing really fancy about it. It looks a little bit old school, even though it is a World War II heavy howitzer. And yeah, how does it do? It do good. I'm going to leave it off. Yeah. This has been another Angry Rouge Unit of the Week. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And as usual, please just take it.